everyone, it's the Rainbow Maiden here. Welcome back to my channel. So this past December, I took another trip to New York City and my friend Xavier tagged along with me. And if you watched the vlog, you may have noticed that when we were at the American Girl store, he really fell in love with one of the characters. I'm kind of in love with her design, like her outfit. So, no. I do. And I don't know if I've shared this on my channel at all before, uh, but Xavier actually really does love dolls. He mostly loves to customize them. Uh, but since he really likes Josefina, and I've been dying to fix up dolls lately, I don't know why, I just keep feeling inspired to fix them up and clean them up right now, I decided to get him his first American Girl doll. So in this video, you get to watch the entire process of me fixing up an old Josefina doll and at the end of the video, we will give it to him as a little present. Not for any particular reason, there's no, there, there's no holiday, no reason to give him a present. It's just, I just wanna give him a present because he's like my best friend, as in like my best friend, like in real life, like in person. Uh, but he's like my best friend and he's one of my really close friends. So I just wanna get him something really cool. So anyways, on with the video. I'm gonna try to do voiceover for this video. I'm really bad at doing voiceovers, but I will give it a shot. So the first thing I took care of was her hair. Um, and let me tell you, it was not an easy task. I think it took me like about an hour or so. I mean, I expect it to be kind of difficult for an older doll, but wow, it was really tangled and I ended up yanking out a lot of hair. <laughs> Thankfully, it wasn't too much hair and she's not bald. So that's good, right? Next, I wanted to clean off all of her vinyl. If you saw my video about fixing up vintage My Little Ponies, uh, you'll know that I usually use this hand sanitizer method, but it wasn't really working out for Josefina and I had to um, uh, use a little nail polish remover. The dirt was just really caked onto her and in order to remove it, I really needed something strong. Of course, the nail polish remover ended up removing her face paint, so I had to paint that back on. But honestly, I think my eyebrows for Josefina look a lot better. I feel like it, uh, it looks better when they're darker. I used a matte finish Mod Podge to seal her eyebrows, and I used a glossy one for her lips. I also noticed that her gold earrings were starting to fade and they looked a little more silver, so I painted them with some gold acrylic paint and sealed them with glossy Mod Podge. And then it was time to redress her. The clothing she came with from the eBay seller was kind of old and stained, so I bought her Be Forever outfit so I could complete the whole outfit, uh, but I ended up going with her original Pleasant Company skirt since I feel like Xavier would have liked that one better anyway. Here she is all done. She looks so lovely. She's fully dressed. I tried to braid her hair, but I'm not really good at braids. She's almost ready to go to Xavier. I just got to put her in a gift bag and she'll be ready to go. So today's the day. Xavier's going to be coming over soon. I just texted him. I texted him like a couple days ago, letting him know uh, that I wanted him to come over. Um, I basically just told him that we're filming a video. That's all he knows. Um, and I just told him it's a secret, it's a surprise, he can't know yet. Um, <laughs> so Josefina is in a cute little blue bag because Xavier, his thing is blue. I got her head there, there it is. Uh, I also have her book, um, her set of accessories, and I also got a spray bottle and a comb for her hair. Uh, Cause you know, when you take care of American Girl dolls, you need a little spray bottle of water and you need a nice little fine tooth comb. Okay, so apparently Xavier cannot leave his house at all because he's home alone with his dog and the dog will freak out if he leaves, if she's home alone. So I have to go to him now. You try to do a nice thing for someone and it just all goes to shit. Love when that happens. I try to make plans. Sorry. It I'm really not excited. I bought the marker. You bring your rats outside? Hi there. Hi there, lovey. <laughs> so, Xavier. Yes. Do you remember we were in New York and we were having a dandy old time? 
I dragged you into the American Girl store, and there was someone there that you really, really liked? Yeah, it was, uh, um... I want to give you this. Oh, my God. <laughs> Take a peek inside. Who knows what it is? How are you feeling? <laughs> you got me an American Girl doll? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, why not? I thought it'd be like a nice thing. I don't know. At least she's pretty. At least she's pretty? You were freaking out over how gorgeous she was. <laughs> you really love Josephine, I don't know. I do. I don't know. I just thought like, oh, she's a really pretty doll and you really like dolls. And I know that you're used to like smaller ones, but I thought like you deserve to have like a really cool doll like Josefina. <laughs> And I've, and also because I've been dying to fix up dolls lately, so I, I bought her off eBay and I fixed her up. And guess what? And I would never have guessed. And guess what, sir? This is the final part of the video, so once it's done editing, you get to watch the whole process of me fixing her. Look oh at that! Oh my god. Power comb. Shower that, comb. Not that, power that's, comb. That's a comb, and there should be a little spray bottle in there. Because the first thing that they teach you when you get an American Girl doll is you need to have like a little bottle of water filled, a little spray bottle of water, and you gotta comb through their hair every now and then, and that's and how you handle it. And this would be great for misting my plants, too. Oh, yeah! That'd be great! <laughs> oh, fuck. Yes, every American Girl comes with the first book of her series, so now you get to learn all about her. She looks completely different, though. I know. <laughs> See the resemblance? I can't. See, she's got a little patch and a lucky coin and her rebozo when she needs some shade and her fancy necklace and a little hanky chip oh, crucifix <laughs> crucifix <laughs> it is so anyways guys that's the video Xavier loves his dolly <laughs> you're gonna have a All friend right. to draw off with that's wonderful see this was a great idea even if you were laughing at it at first I was just laughing because I wasn't expecting you to do yeah. that I was not <laughs> she left me in the blue yeah and she was just like, I just, just five minutes. And then I was like, I thought it'd just, I thought it'd just be something like, you know, taking pictures of her in a nice outfit or something. Yeah. But, but now I'm doing something for you because I actually do care about you. I care about you too. Thank oh, you. Oh, thank you.